So you, when you do this, so when I'm going for this, the way you know what to do is by where his pressure is. If he starts to sink this shoulder into me, that means it's going to be fairly easy for me to roll him over. If he sinks his shoulder this way, like, sit through, yeah, if he sits through like this, don't waste any energy trying to do that technique. When this happens, what you're going to do is you're going to bring your thumb around, bring my hand inside, bring my hand inside, ideally between his bicep and his uh, shoulder here. I'm going to turn into him, bring my knee in, and shrink my elbow to the floor. Make sure you get your elbow to the floor here, because most likely in this position, he's going to let go of this grip, kind of grab my elbow, and pull it up. But this is not a one yet. He wants to strip me back here. So I pose in the armpit as he goes to reach back. Normally, you need to get pretty few knees. Now I can have from his face. I get my knee inside. Just break through. Go back to Or just shrimp back to work. I want you guys to get used to I go here, he sits through. I don't continue. If you were to try to bump here, you're just going to burn yourself out. Bring your hand to the inside. Make sure that the top arm extends and the bottom arm shrinks. Have your partner be uh, built. So one is going to try to pull his arm away from you. The other one, he's going to try to grab your head again. Come back up to his knees, you have a good, uh, strong post in his arm. Post in the head, shoot away, and your knee through, and get back to your body. Right. You can use this one anytime, even if I didn't try that initial sweep, sit to your hip. When the person sits through like this, when they're holding you like this, this is, this is how you would escape. I bring my thumb across, push and pull, and then again, you try to do it. You sit up, and you put your hand in. Yeah. Right. Okay, great.